that's a dead guy. That's pretty cool. Uh, new episode begins right now, so let's go. Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen, to State of Decay 2, the Lethal Zone. In the last episode, I reluctantly moved to Trumbull Valley because that's what you guys wanted to see. We are officially in the new map. We have a very shitty base and no way to upgrade until we take out this plague heart right here. So, that's exactly what the goal of this episode is. In the last episode, we took out the plague cart that was actually literally right next door, and I still haven't even looted it. Lima almost died, but we saved him just in the nick of time. We have no plague cure. We have ve no grenades, no molotovs, nothing explosive. All we have are guns and will to live. So, hopefully that'll get us far enough. Now, first things first. Let's go see what's inside this plague heart. Oh, well, fuck, there was plague samples right here. <laughs> I could have just done it that way. Whatever, fair enough. I mean, hey, you know what? It doesn't matter. We got it. We're good. We're happy. It's good. It's a good thing. We're not sad about what happened. Also, my car is blown up. So I have no way to get out of here. Things are looking pretty grim, if I'm being frank. And then let's use the base to craft a plague here. This is the only one that we have, so I cannot fuck this up. Hey, Frank, I'm actually gonna bring more zombies to you, so... Heads up. Is anybody out there? Help! Yeah, I'm right Thank here, God, jackass. Here. What do you want? Okay. Hey. What's the deal? You're gonna clear out a nearby infestation? Why not? Sure. Maybe someone would want this. Yeah, us. We want that. It's ammo. We kind of desperately need it. Thank goodness. Something we can use. So you don't want the 556 five, rounds, but you're super cool with emery boards? Woody, just go. Just run. Woody, it's not worth it. Woody, I'm telling you, just Perhaps run. It's I, I'm not gonna help you. Where's the screamer? Which one of you is the screamer? Ah, there he is. Glad totally fucking everything up. Okay. Come on, everyone, line up, single file. Make this easy on me. I'm not the best shot in the world, so the less you move, the better it is for me. Please take your body armor and shove it directly up your ass. Woody, I don't know if I accidentally shot you. If I did, I'm sorry. Woody, you gotta do something, man. I, I really don't care what you do. You just have to do something. Glad I'm on your side. Are you? I honestly can't tell if you're making things better or worse for me. Stop running. I need them to stand still. Just let him eat you for a second. Help me out. Woody, if you die to the last zombie, I'm... I don't even know. I was gonna say I'll kill you, but I guess that's a bit redundant. Woody, for fuck's sake, the baseball bat that's in your hand, use it. I'm not accompanying you. Get there yourself, asshole. Trade with Enclave? Like hmm. Maybe you're not a bad guy. I'll take that, too. I really gotta get her shooting skill up. I really gotta get my shooting skill up, frankly, but... Excuse me, sir! Thank you for your time. Oh, you guys decided to... Re really? Re really? Really? Oh, unbelievable. Woody, if you don't die, I'll happily chat with you. Gotta pass that prerequisite first, though. Oh, Woody. You know, I bet you if you could, you could probably take all the clips I said involving Woody and make it seem like I was having sex with him. There it is. All right. Well, bye, Woody. All right. Technically, now would be a really good time to use one of these painkillers, but I'm gonna hope that I can. I'm dead. Well, that was a complete and total waste of time. But it's not my fault that these guys literally made their base literally next to a plague heart. We take the crossbow, we go out, and we're gonna go out and collect some plague samples. 
just to get us a plague cure or two. And that's a horde. Oh boy. Calm down. Not, nah, don't snap onto that. Oh, baby. I know aim snap was a large part in that, but god damn, I could not have cut that a lot closer. Alright, any plague samples? You're telling me I didn't get one plague sample out of that whole ordeal? You guys come from. Can you guys get out of the fart cloud so I can see you easier? Now, we're gonna go back up to town, repair that car, any luck, get it back home. While also trying to scavenge for our plague samples along the way. Really? Not not a single not a single one, huh? I guess I'm empty. Yeah, shout it louder, why don't you? Make sure everyone can hear it. All of those bolts and uh didn't come out of the deal with a single plague sample. Which is uh once again super cool, let me tell ya. I'm not gonna lie, this this zombie just seems chill as fuck. She's just she's just fucking vibing. She's just looking at the looking at the sunlight. Taking in the view of the lovely fast food plate. Oh, she's not vibing anymore. Alright, vibe check. I'm stuck. Why did I get spawned here? Stick with me here, folks. This is gonna be a minute. It's painkillers. Why would we trade that to somebody? It just made my day. Tequila. But you don't want to trade that. You want to trade the painkillers to somebody, but the tequila, you got to keep that for yourself, huh? I swear, these survivors do not understand loot. They'll get like a fucking M16 and be like, I don't know, maybe we can break it down for parts and get something out of it. And then they'll get a stray tampon that they found in a random medical locker. And they're like, oh shit, this is the good stuff right here. Reload, big boy AK, with that fucking entire time. muffler worth of way. ammo. All right. Here we go. We have a plan officially. We have energy drinks to help keep our stamina up. We have plenty of ammo. We have boom boxes to hopefully distract the zombies, though I don't think that'll be too successful. And from there, we just got to unload everything we can into this into this play card. So, fuck you, Feral. Uh, I messed up. I messed up. Hang on. I messed up. Time out. Off the car. Off the car. Reloading. We'll reload then. Totally out of spare you can't just say reloading and then not actually. Oh shit. Oh shit. Uh, wasn't ready for the feral. Hang on a minute. Get up there. That's fine. Just stay right here. Don't move. Don't move. Don't fall off the car. Where's the feral at? Where is he at? Where is he at? There he is, you cutie. We're actually not going to use this, though. There we go. Good, 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 good. Take this back out. Put one of these down. Completely out of ammo. No, you're not. You still got 113 more AK rounds. Don't be so pessimistic. Oh, you're all there's always one of you around, isn't there? Can we jump on this building? You bet your ass we can. Good, 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 good. We're okay. We're doing well. We're doing well, actually. Another boom box. There we go! Easy fucking peasy! It don't get any better than that, ladies and gentlemen. Home site can be claimed. Get us in here, bro. Get us in here. That was the best clear yet? What can I say? I'm a kind of a badass. It's got some tricks to it. So if you need help getting it fixed back up, give me a call. Thanks, pal. We'll do. Alright, farm. 
Watchtower. Call Chavez for help. Get help repairing the Watchtower. Sure. So, we need to actually do missions to fix the Watchtower. Little bit unfortunate. Alright, let's go see what Chavez's deal is. Or I guess we won't. Never mind. We should find a way to get electricity hooked up. You should find a way to get off of your ass and help. That's what you should find, sweetheart. Oh my god, our home is just surrounded by these things. Are you sure? Hey, any if whenever you guys want to step in and help. No rush. Hang on, before, before I kill you, let me close the door real quick. Whatever. Oh shit. Can anyone just- there you- wow, nice shot, Lena. See, Lena actually sucks as a survivor, but I just gave her a 50 caliber rifle, and she kind of just stays at home and completely wrecks anything that comes by base, so it's nice, because NPCs have unlimited ammo. Can you- not be 300 meters away next time? Is that an option, or...? Who the hell is this guy? Apparently there was a bloater there. He was bush camping, the bastard. There's a place nearby that might have just what you need. Okay. The used to live there would buy just about anything, so it's the best place to look. Did there really have to be a giant ravine in the middle of this? From what I hear, this place we're headed used to be like a refugee camp or something. These days it's abandoned like everything else. Just like you, Chavez. Am I right? Up top. Sorry, sore subject or got a freak over here. Oh, you're right. Oh, there's three. Oh, this is just lovely. Aim for the head. Ah. Ah. Please jump. Not gonna lie, that's a little bit unfortunate. How's it feel when you're the one who's out fucking numbered, huh? Huh? Go ahead, bring all the friends, bring the whole family. Not good. Sucks a little bit, doesn't it, Pharaoh, huh? I feel so sorry for you. I was, we were, we were right fucking here. We were right here. My objective was right there and we were right here. And now Kuna's fucking dead. Just had to move maps. Couldn't stay where we were at. Had a beautiful setup going on, but no, you guys wanted Trumbull Valley, and now Kuna's dead. You did this. All right, I'm sorry. I, I took out some aggression on you guys. It's 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 my fault. I didn't execute everything properly, and uh, it's my bad. Uh, you know what? I think I was projecting some things. There we go. And uh, yeah, I'm sorry. Hell Still yeah. pissed though. There you go. Okay, can I have it back? Thank you. Glad, glad you could. I mean, you, you couldn't help Kuna stay alive, huh? You couldn't, you couldn't do that. But uh, you, you, you could, you could, you could look at this fucking computer card for me, and tell me it's exactly what I needed. Thanks. Anyway, now that Kuna's fucking dead, you want to come live with us and help out, or is that still a no? Hey, what's up with you? Oh, I don't have a suppressor on this. That was a bad idea. Okay, uh, well, frankly, I've got a lot of work to do in my off time, so we're gonna go ahead and call this episode right here. Not gonna lie, not as great as the last episode, but hopefully I'll be able to fix things up around here. Thank you, everybody, so much for watching. A very special thanks to ContemptEXE, Bama1012, and Dreadman Cometh for showing up here live. I appreciate you lads being here. 
and Quack Nations as well for being here live. Uh, as for you YouTube folks, you can leave a like or a dislike, but if you leave a dislike, leave criticism, because it'll really help me improve. And as always, enjoy the rest of your day.